Hello, YouTube! Welcome back to episode 39 of our Pokemon Gold Randomized Nuzlocke. I am Masterfish Plus, your resident Pokemon Master. Man, last episode was an interesting one. We uh, did a little encounter. Uh, nothing too serious in the World Islands. And then we fought Sabrina and won. That's it. Not much happened. Let's do a team recap. Our team begins with Nerves, the Articuno. Been here since an egg. One of not one of the most one of the more amazing things that's happened to us in this incredibly bountiful run. Holding the lucky egg because we're still trying to get him to level 55. Knows Ice Beam. It's a good deal. Dr. Timmy. He uh he's a doctor. He cleans teeth for a living, holds an amulet coin, makes a lot of money. Gojira the Tyranitar, holding uh has the shades, was once the objectively strongest mon on our team, apparently still gonna learn Earthquake. Redentia the Raticate, our rat wearing the polka dot bow now. We found a new bow for her, so we had to give it to her. And Bowsette the Slowbro, holding Mystic Water. Very, very big, very pink, very mean. And then, you know, the thing, the mon that we caught in, in the World Islands. <laughs> Lord Plasma, the Raikou. <laughs> it's still hilarious. Holding the magnet to make that spark even stronger. We taught him Fire Blast. Actually, we taught him Fire Blast, and that's just for fun. But, you know, I've been holding on to this. I've been holding on to this for a while. And if we have a move that would be perfect... There we go. Let's up the PP of Fire Blast. Yeah. I'm still amazed. I'm still amazed that we were able to get this as our encounter. It's such a low percentage. Such, you know, I was hoping for something with uh, at least, at least base 500 stats. You know, I wasn't, I wasn't saying, oh, we, we need, uh, we need a legendary. I was like, if we could get like a starter, if we could get something with a three stage evolution, you know, that would be amazing. I would be just perfectly happy with that. No, we get Raikou. We get Lord Plasma. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness gosh. What a crazy thing. All right. <laughs> but we do have a lot of, we still have a lot of, a lot of encounters. Oh my goodness. Just encounter after encounter. I said we were going to go to the spot between Lavender and Saffron. And I fully intend to do that if they show us. That's Route 8. So we have Route 7 and Route 8. Let's get those both right now because that'll... That'll kind of clean up our stuff. All right. Uh, we need Timmy out front, because he is going to give the business to whatever we run into. Unless, of course, we can just catch it, but we know how these Kanto encounters go. We don't just catch things. We need to fight for them. That is species. We have a Rapidash. I'm surprised I can remember all this. We have, we have coming up on 60 encounters that I have tried to keep track of, so if I'm forgetting one, let me know. Oh, man. And this was our Ho-Oh. We caught this as a Ho-Oh. I'm not gonna, you know, I'm not gonna spend terribly long here. I gotta say. The only reason we're still doing encounters, and it's, it's even a poor reason, is because of potential losses. I'm gonna encounter a couple more times and I'm out of here. If we lose a mod, we need something to put back in, and I fully, I expect to lose someone. I mean, as we add Plasma to the team and we get to level 55 here, I do not expect a great, okay, Zatu. We might have a not to, but I don't remember seeing it, so let's just grab this. Uh, I wonder if it has more. I wonder if it has more than 52 HP. I have zero reason not to try it. I mean, Zatu's great and all, but we can afford to just speed through encounters here. I would I would have loved the Zatu much earlier. Okay, yeah, didn't have enough. Oops. Chalk that up as a loss, my bad. Yeah, you can you guys can probably see I'm not very worried. We're just on a we're coasting to the end of the game here. And then we're just going to find out if a level 70 Raiko can take on red. Am I going to grind or grind? Am I going to put the lucky egg on Raiko and level him up? Lord Plasma. Uh 
Signs point to no. I don't think he's gonna get many levels even if we did that. Oh, here we go. We got the Bicyclers 3. We're the Kanto Pokemon Federation Trainer Group. We'll drive you under our we- Oh my gosh. Ease up, guys. <laughs> that's a- that's a motorcycle. If Clerk Cammy runs me over, I'm a- I'm a dead man. And here we go. We did it again, guys. Congratulations to me. We didn't- we didn't switch back to nerves, and now we're doing more fights with Timmy. Gotta leave myself notes on this stuff. Just don't for, for, don't forget to switch your Pokemon out mid-battle. Holy cow. Well, that's just how it goes, you know? Um, what are we doing here? Switching now. Switching right now. Switch, switch, switch. What are these? I still want to do the run where we do the no... No set. This is a terrible switch. This is an awful switch to do. <laughs> but the no set run, or the no switch run rather, where, you know, we don't switch out every time someone can throw out another mod. I don't think this game's hard enough to worry about it. I mean, seriously, this guy's got a level 33 Charizard, and Lance had a level 57. I don't know why the. Why are the trainer levels so low? There's no good reason for it. I just, I don't get it. Don't understand. Whatever. Did they fix it in the net later games? That's what I want to know. I can't remember. Of course. Of course my memory fails me on that. But are those at least level 50? You want to know what had a great post-game... Well, actually, I don't know about that. Post-game leveling. Black and white too, I believe. They got, they got your team up to, like, level 70, I swear. It was something like that. It was something nuts. Anyway. We forgot to switch again! Oh, that's a good thing. That's fine. I'm, I'm okay with that. I'm okay with the fact that we didn't switch. Wow, talk about lucky. We needed, we needed Timmy to do this anyway. There's no way anything on our team... Well, how much you want to bet Lord Plasma could one-hit KO Wobbuffet? How much you want to bet I'm not going to find out? If he lives on one and clicks Miracle. <laughs> oh, what a way to go. I'd never live that down. I would never, ever, ever, ever live that down. That would chase me until I died. You lot losing a, losing the Raikou. Wait a second, I've been countered with that. No, I haven't. I, I guess... I guess Nightshade needs... It's technically a physical move. But the computer keeps using Miracoat whenever I use it. So bizarre. What a, what an interesting one mon to have. That's it's like it's programmed to be that way. Forgive me. I will not. Your first buddy said he was going to run me over. Why would I forgive you? I guess you didn't do anything. It's all about intent. Right? WRONG! Yeah, you're the Federation. Right on, dude! Ah, oh, for sure! I totally forgive him now. He's a... He's a bro. <laughs> right on, bro! <laughs> I'm Clerk Wayne. Let's battle. Here's a Typhlosion, dude. Ha! <laughs> I love it. How to, how to 180 my perception of you. Well, I still gotta beat him up. I like you. That's why I'm going to end it quickly. And... Farewell. Oh! Let's see how much of this does. I'm genuinely curious. Level 37 Typhlosion uses Stab Flame Wheel. That was a crit. Dang. 80 damage. Well, 78 damage. Who's counting? Me, apparently. More Dark Arts and... Goodbye... You. Goodbye. <laughs> Wiggly tough. Let's just finish out with nerves and then switch to Gojira, I think. Gojira and nerves are the hardest to level in my team. Followed closely by... I don't know. I don't know who. 
Oh, that's that's ignoring Lord Plasma. Lord Plasma is really hard. Like for real, I don't know. I don't know if you guys knew this, but here's a little Pokemon Master tip I can give you. Some Mons actually just take longer to level than other Mons. Legendaries and pseudo legendaries take more EXP. Just no two ways about it. They are harder to level by too much, in my opinion. It takes a real long time. Anyway. Good, good. Making the switch. Who else is out here? Oh, here's the grass. Rodentia! Thank you. What do we got? Show me something wild. Show me something serious. Show me a bell sprout. Well, we have one of those. As you can see by the pokey ball. What do we name ours? Is it a male or a female? Pretty sure it's James. I name Oh! Look at him! He looks fun! Come on, just be nice. Just get in the ball. Just, just do it for me. Please? He's not gonna. Wow, he did it! Why do I feel like we caught one of these? If you think that you had a good dream, but you can't remember it, a drowsy has probably eaten it. Oh, what do we nickname a female drowsy? Ah, oh, jeez. Um, it's a tape here that eats your dreams. Um, I just heard some wild noises. Sorry, I don't know what that was. Man, this basement, I'm telling you. Yes, I'm recording in a basement. Shoot, I shouldn't have mentioned that. Um, we're gonna give you a great nickname. Roberta. There we go. That's a good nickname. I like it. Roberta. I can roll that R. Yeah, we're not gonna fight that man. Uh, we are in a hurry. Yes, I know the EXP is good, but it's not gonna matter. We already fought you? Oh, sweet. Um, so this is Route... Did we get an encounter here? I thought we skipped this one. This is Route 12. Let me check. R12. We... Oh, shoot. Drowsy. Route 12. No, we can fish here. Uh, is there some grass? I'd rather do grass than fish. Oh, shoot. Did we do... Gosh, dang it. I wish they had the route things. That comes in crystal, I believe. Route 11. We did route 11. We got him Meowth. Okay, good. Who lives here? Did we do this already? I'm the fishing guru's younger brother. I can see that you like fishing. There's no doubt in my mind at all. Am I right? Just as I thought. Here's a super rod. Yes. Try fishing anywhere. Thanks, red shirt. Red shirt. Ooh, he wants to battle. Well, I got a Gojira for you. What's most important in our everyday lives? Milk? Is it milk? Is it drinking lots of milk? Oh. Okay. Maybe it's that. Maybe it's Kabuto. I don't know. Hey, Gojira, eat it. I bet Tyranitar... I bet a Tyranitar could eat a Kabuto. Just legit. Crunch down on it. Break that shell. Have some shellfish. I bet it would work. The Tyranitar could eat anything. Name, name 18 things Tyranitar couldn't eat. And then maybe I'll believe you. There we go, level 53. Oh, Earthquake. Yeah, so my buddy was telling me apparently Gojira will learn Earthquake at level 61. Uh, place your bets now if we even get Gojira that high. If I use Gojira for every single gym battle until red, I don't think it'll get... I don't think she'll reach level 61. Man, we are gonna get messed up by red. <laughs> and yet somehow I think it'll be a surprising battle in many ways. This tree can be cut. A soul can't be cut. Revive! More like... Useless. Wait, what is this? Look at this nonsense. Oh, man. Well, here's our encounter. 
Here's our Route 12 encounter. Never mind, it is Eradicate. It's apparently one of my more funny moments. When that, when our riot, when Goblin sent out that Raticate and I went, never mind. Everyone found that funny. I don't get it. I don't get you guys. I'm dropping some real humor out here and that's what you find funny? Killing me. Are we in a new route? I feel like the screen just did that little shimmy shake. It did. All right. Well, see if you can catch it. There it was. It just happened. It was extremely subtle. It's like you can you pick it up in your peripherals. I don't know if you could have possibly seen it, guys. All right, let's get that super rod. Oh shoot, what do we do with the red scale? I, I, uh, man, I don't remember. Not even a nibble. Oops, went on our bike. Don't need that. Why are we doing super rod? We're gonna get a mon that's way, that's way too powerful. Actually, unless we want another Gengar and another Doug Trio. This, yeah, we need to do this. Because the other the other rods are Gengar and Doug Trio. It's universal for some reason. So what is it? Pikachu! Ow! Oh, it's a Pikachu! It's a level 40 Pikachu. Jeez. Hey, Redentia. You're going to eat another mouse. Well, actually, Redentia's a rat. Uh, which is like... Um... A mouse that took steroids. Yep. Rodentia is chock full of illegal substances. You guys knew that, right? You guys aren't gonna You guys aren't gonna call the cops on Rodentia, are you? Please don't. Last time someone did that it got messy. There were a couple accidents, if you know what I mean. Hey Rodentia, you super fang! Get this Pikachu down low! Nice. It doesn't get any redder than that. I don't know where the cutoff is in this gen. Apparently, in the, as we go on through the generations, as you'll see, I hope. Hey, there we go. What did I nickname Pikachu? Oh, jeez. This intelligent Pokemon roasts hard berries with electricity and make them tender enough to eat. All right. Berry. Berry Blast. My favorite flavor. <laughs> What's your favorite flavor of items? Is that just two... Is this just two dudes standing next to each other? It is. Check out my Pokemon. Just look at their coloring and their plumage. Dude. Show me that plumage. Lay down some sweet plumes, dude. Ace Trainer Stacy. Oh, that's some plumage, dude. <laughs> What's with these ace? What's with the bird catchers actually having birds that are amazing? Remember the last one? He had a Pidgeot. You're just like, check out my. Well, actually, it was like, tweet, tweet, dude. Send out a Pidgeot. This one has a Lugia. Everyone's get a, getting Lugia. I'd love a Lugia. Aerodactyl? Told you, look at his birds. He's flying high, dude. Ah, uh, let me hit that with crunch. It's gonna, it's gonna hurt. I bet Gajira can eat an Aerodactyl. Come on. Aerodactyl's bite size compared to Gojira. Oh, shoot, not good enough. So I was looking through the Pokedex the other day. Did you know Mewtwo is 6'7 and 280 pounds? I want you to think about that for a second. Think about yourself. The average American male is 5'10 and about 200. Really, really let that sink in about how gigantic and just jacked Mewtwo is. Alright, you thinking about that? Now put psychic powers on top of how jacked he is. Mewtwo could legit probably squat like three to four hundred pounds. <laughs> and on top of that, he has enough psychic ability to lift buildings. Mewtwo is the ultimate life form. 
Fight me. There is not a stronger Pokemon than Mewtwo. He's a man-made killing machine. That's what he is. Jeepers creepers, dude. I was... I was wigging out. I was wigging out the other day about that. Like, Mewtwo is huge! Holy crap! If, if he was a... If he had only just a hundred... If he had a hundred pounds more. If he was a hundred pounds heavier, he would be the size of, like, those power lifters that you hear about. Oh, it'd be nuts. I would pay to see... I'd pay to see Mewtwo, period. Mewtwo's pretty cool. We could've had one. Could've had one! Nope! We could've had one while we were still able to grind. Nope! Not for us. Not gonna happen. That isn't what we get. I can't be mad. We caught a... Uh, an Ivysaur instead. Ivysaur is great. Can't use it, but it's great. I don't foresee us losing any Mons until red. There's no two ways about it. Why is why is this dude at level 26 Mons? This is almost it's almost a waste of time. Like I'm not speed running the game or anything here, but I do want to get to red before we hit episode 60. Just saying. Just saying, bro. I'm not do I don't want to do 60 ep 22 more episodes of this just because we can't get to red. You guys got six mons. You gotta be kidding me with this. Your other boy had a Lugia and Aerodactyl. What's up with that? He's doing the he's doing the light training. He's keeping a team of powerhouses. Not unlike our own. But Pikachu! Oh. We're already on this guy. Man, I'm talking so much, I don't even know where I am anymore. Can we get through here? Yes. Okay, here's our Route 13 encounter. Show me the money. Oh, it's a Polyrath! Sweet, I'll take that. I'd, I love Polyrath. I wish we could use a Polyrath. I would probably, I would probably use the Polyrath instead of... How was that, to be honest with you? I just, well, I love the fighting type. That is probably my favorite typing. I like fighting types the most, and then probably dark type. Why? Because I'm an edgy boy. I'm all edge. I'm fists and edge. Yeah, I'm proud of it, too. Cut yourself coming near me. Come on, there we go. All right, Ultra Ball should take this, because it's not a man time. You know Mantine with the .001 catch rate. Polyrath should be much easier. And I expected a little trouble, okay? It wasn't gonna be perfect. But it should stay here now, right? Hmm. Hmm. Huh? Huh? Come on. There we go. All right, pick a fighter. Who are we naming you after today? Uh, this strong and skilled swimmer is even capable of crossing the Pacific Ocean just by kicking. Well, we're not naming you after a fighter. We are naming you after a swimmer. I... Michael. Michael. Michael P. <laughs> All right, we call him Michael P. It's Michael. That's Michael Phelps. Dude with unlimited swimming power. All right, let's let's get out. Of, let's try to get out of here. Uh, we're gonna have to fight this man. Unless we skip him. There's gonna be a trainer right at... No? Okay, sweet. And we have to fight this man. Or this guy's gonna walk out. Yep, all right, thanks. Thanks for trolling us. I should go to Rocktown to get myself an Onyx. You should probably fall off the face of the earth. Gotta be kidding me with this. And I bet, because we fought this guy like this, we have to go all the way around and fight the other dude too. Electabuzz, more like Thunder Punch. <sighs> 
Calm down, Master Fish Plus. It's okay. You got all the time in the world, so long as it takes less than five minutes. I do longer episodes, but... I feel like this is optimal. I don't know. It's my fault for not using speed up. I just don't like the idea. I see, I've seen a lot of runners get wrecked by using speed up. Speed up just magnifies stupid moves. I've seen it happen. They'll speed up and they, they're in on something they shouldn't be, but they're like, eh, I'm speeding anyway. I may as well just leave this Articuno in against this Aerodactyl that's seven levels above it. Wait. I did that. Crap! Guess I should use speed up, huh? Growlithe. That's cute. Must I say again, I would have loved an Arcanine? Arcanine. R. K. 9. I don't know. Say Pokemon names wrong for long enough and you forget what they originally were. I lost. Yes, you did. Go get that Onyx. Maybe it'll save you. All right, are we free? I mean, we're not. We're not free. But this is Route 14 now. So we did... Oh, crap. I already... Route 12. Yeah, I'll just do this after the episode. Route 14 now. Oh, jeez. Oh, hello, man. Stay out of my... Stay out of my life. Stay out. We gotta switch some items back. We are done leveling Gojira for now. And we're gonna switch on over to Timmy the Tooth. The greatest of all teeth. Here we go. And no more money, but plenty more levels. That's what I like to see, Timmy. Oh, shoot. Did you battle all the gym trainers? What do you mean? Like, in the gyms, the trainers? Technically, no. We skipped a bunch in Sabrina's gym. And I did that on purpose. What was the purpose? I knew they'd be useless. They're all useless. Man. Gengar with Spore is busted. Whoa! <laughs> nice shot! Holy crap! That did some damage. <laughs> Just spat it out. <laughs> Alright. As nice as that noise was. Pincer's done. Goodbye. Goodbye, Pincer. It was a pleasure. I'm too tough for you, dude. Give up. This is the Chansey grass. This is where you can catch Chansey, I believe. But we're gonna catch Pit. Well... I'm not catching that. I'm not gonna do it. You can't make me. <laughs> I, I refuse. Lapras is cute, but I don't have it. Do you have Lapras? Want to trade for my horsey? I would love to if I had a Lapras. That lady's looking for Chance. I think Chancey? Speak of the devil! She wants a horsey! Well, here's a Seedra. Timmy! Clean its teeth! Oh no! It has no teeth! What am I supposed to do? Timmy, do something! Yeah, that'll work. Pillage its dreams. I knew it had more than 50, 50 X, 50 whatever HP. I knew it. I knew that. I was cognizant of the truth. Hey, We caught it. What's the name of those things in One Piece? The Sea Emperors? An examination of its cells revealed the presence of gene not found in horsey. It became a hot topic. Oh yeah? Uh, let's call it Sea Emperor. I think that's what they're called. I always forget. They stop talking about them. Nobody talks about the Sea Emperors anymore because they don't matter. There we go. All right. Who's calling us? Lawrence! Uh, yeah, they're great. No, I don't want to battle. Really? You want me to shut down your whole team again? Come on, dude. 
I'm in a different region. I don't have time for you. All right. All right. With that, we're done with today's episodes. We only got about 15,000 encounters, and there's still 15,000 to go. But we're going to try to get through this and get to Red and take him out with Lord Plasma. We're going to bring in the grenade. So stay tuned for, oh, for episode 40. Jeez. Hope to see you in the next one, guys. But for now, farewell. Farewell.